Hi everybody. It's October 13th and I'm finally back in the garden. It's really huh, so much cooler out and just out here bringing in my house plants that need to come in because it might freeze tonight. You never know. So bringing in my succulents that need to come in and that big gigantic lemon tree there in the blue pot that has got to come in the house but huh, see it is kind of a worse for the wear of the garden but still beautiful lots and lots of seeds happening now and here, let me get up. Still some beautiful purple basil there. Blooming. I want to harvest that. And got lots of peppers to pick today yet. Lots of these beautiful peppers. They're hard to see from up here, but if you come down here, you can see them all hanging on the plant. They pretty? Yeah. So I will be sad to see that go if it does decide to get down to freezing tonight. But I'm all ready for next year anyway. I'm excited. Got lots of plans. Right Orion? So we've got lots of plans. That's Orion. Aw, oh, his water bowl is empty. I will fill it. I know, I'll fill it up. See what's left of the very little bit of zinnias. And I leave a lot of the plant debris that's dead over the winter as it is for the insects because it gives them some place to hunker down for the winter. Speaking of hunkering down, I don't know if you can see, but there's a little inchworm or something on there. Yeah, it's not going to focus, but it's there. So, and it's been a great summer here. There's such a beautiful breeze. And look who took my chair, Doug, in a pissy mood today. Huh, Doug? Did you take my chair? Did you take mom's chair, Doug? Going to say hi? Are you going to say hi? Say no, I'm not talking to you right now. He's mad because Orion. Uh, it's a long story. Anyway, he's in a bad mood. So, But Algernon's never in a bad mood. A little bit of parsley left and the sage is, of course, still here few pretty zinnias. Yeah. Anyhow, I just thought I'd show you what's left in the garden. Look at all that beautiful basil yet. Yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna pick that and make some more pesto. So I better go because this stuff is not going to do itself. And if it does decide to get down to freezing tonight, that basil will not survive. So, got to get some peppers picked, some more plants brought in. It's pretty cool. I'll probably pick that coleus and put it in a jug of water because it can live in the water all winter. And this was beautiful butterfly weed. See the beautiful seed pods on it. And just blow in the wind. Set them free in the wind so they can reseed. Look at this, it's uh, crazy. Yeah, so lots of catnip yet. It's really been <sighs> bittersweet today because it's time for the garden to go. It's finally nice out again. 
and uh, it's going to be over soon. So, anyway, but lots of stuff for next year. So, everybody have a beautiful October. Th oh, I didn't show you. These are beautiful yet. Let's see if I can make my way through here. Sweet Annie out of the way. Here's a whole bunch of spinner gourds I have to collect too, but the frost the frost won't hurt them. See. I'm just little Tennessee. Oh here's a dried one. See, aren't they cute? I had to gather them up, but that's not a priority. Still have beautiful cherry tomatoes on there. I should pick them. I can eat those green. Ah caught in my jungle, but here's the beautiful Mexican sage. Look at that. I see it. It's beautiful and purple. And there's a bumblebee. Happy, happy. Look at him. He's getting some yummy nectar out of that bad boy. Aww. Yeah. Definitely a beautiful plant that survived the drought. Look at this bee. He's a happy bee. Oh, I love you. I love, here's another gourd. You get out of here before I break my neck. Come through this jungle. There's kitty cats and some pretty zinnias with a little butterfly on there. Just a little skipper. And then my pineapple sage is starting to bloom. So. I, I kind of really hope it doesn't freeze because this has lots of buds to come out on it yet. But just we'll have to wait and see. So anyhow, everybody have a beautiful day, and uh, we will get busy in the garden. Yeah. Look, there's some cherry tomatoes I can pick and eat. They're perfectly ripe. Ooh. Yum. Anyway, all right. Love you guys, and let's say goodbye to Grumpy Doug. Hung Grumpy Doug. Say bye, everybody. Love you.